Hello everybody and welcome back to X4 where you might notice I'm basically broke right now. That is because we have a huge trade, at least <laughs> for right now, a huge trade coming in of advanced electronics. We have our merchant ship coming down over this way to pick up some advanced electronics in this area and we are buying them for about 900 credits each. And then we are selling them up over here for 13, 18 credits each. So that's going to be a very, very large profit for us. And that will give us what we need to be able to upgrade our Elite Vanguard, which is going to be a crappy ship still, probably, but a slightly upgraded crappy ship. <laughs> so that should be something in the spectrum of ideal anyway. So where is our Mercury Vanguard right now? It is currently in a place that I don't know. Ah, it's down here. It's buying the advanced electronics. These were for a, about 900-ish when I set it up. Of course, the price has gone up a little bit because we just bought out a huge section of their stock. So that's great. We now have the advanced electronics. And we are going to be undocking and heading up over this way. And you may notice that there is also an advanced electronics trade for the same amount in this system here, but there's not enough to cover our entire ship cargo bay. So we're just taking it up here where it's the same price and there's high enough demand. So that's the plan for right now. We do also still have our ice ship working over here and we have our ore ship Working over here, it is currently calculating parameters. I think it's slightly confused. And it doesn't exactly know where it's supposed to uh, buy this, or, or rather where it's supposed to do this ore from. And actually, I'm going to get rid of these funds for station construction. Okay, there we go. Excellent. Because we need to go pick up our benefactor, which is going to be exciting. But for that to happen, I do not want this order to happen. Remove this order. Okay. Where are you going? Hang on. Oh yeah, you're going to the Argon Wharf. That's fine. That's exactly where you're supposed to go. Perfect. So we're going to just get a huge chunk of income right now. And then we'll probably need to set up another trade. I still like the advanced electronics trade. If we can get a decent supplier for it. Like, there's this over here. They do have 901. That's still decent. Can we get it over in this region any cheaper? Not really. Okay. Okay. Well, that's fine. You can run this trade route again. And then we'll have to reevaluate it, certainly, after this one. So, I don't want energy cells. I want to purchase these. Oh, this is the drill. Hang on. <laughs> we need to select our Mercury Vanguard. And then we purchase these. They only have... We can only get 20? Oh, because I don't have this money in yet. Right. So we have to wait for this trade to finish. That's fine. We'll wait for that. It should be done any moment now. This guy should be docked. Or docking. Maybe? It's a definite maybe. And I do want to upgrade this ASAP because I want to get moving for right now. So we're just waiting on this last little bit of credits to come in, I guess. And then we'll issue those orders and go pick up our benefactor. You are currently flying. Fair enough. We are docked at this station, so it has to actually come in and land because we could potentially see it 
as opposed to most of the other ones where it just like jitters around out here for a little bit and then is like, hey, I'm docked. And I'm like, yeah, I believe you. <laughs> so we are going to drop off 273 advanced electronics here. I'll just hop out here. We should be seeing it coming in at some point relatively soon. It's going to land in one of these big bays here. Looks like it is currently thinking about coming in. There it is. It's going to it's going to ram that other ship. <laughs> this is not this is not ours. This is the AI ship. This is a uh, Argon High Tech Trader Mercury Vanguard. But this Mercury Vanguard is our Mercury Vanguard. So here it comes. It will be docking momentarily. And then the trade will complete. Fantastic. Look at all that money coming in. Glorious. Excellent. So the trade will complete momentarily, and we are just going to head back into our ship quickly. Something kind of like this. Elite Vanguard. Okay. And there's our trade. Excellent. Now I want to upgrade to all-around Mark III engines. And I also want to... I'm okay with our thrusters being the way they are. I want to put possibly Mark III shields on this. And we're currently with a Mark I pulse laser. We could go for a Mark II pulse laser. And then we could go for a docking computer, just a, a cheapo docking computer, something like that, so that I don't have to dock this anymore. Okay, that's going to be most of our credits. But that's okay. We'll get that upgraded. And in the meantime, we can get the Mercury Vanguard moving back over here, but I'm not actually going to buy the electronics that are available over here just yet. Because we don't have the credits for it. Like, we can only buy 50 of these right now, and I'm pretty sure... Yeah, that's not even close to filling our hold. So we'll head over there, and while that's on the way, we will get money via other sources for a little while. And as soon as our ship is done upgrading here, we will head off and go pick up our benefactor. Which will be done in about five seconds. Okay. Let's go. Let's, uh... Head out over here, and let's see just how much better this ship is now. It should be reasonably better. 180 was our previous top speed. Yeah, this is quite a lot better, to be sure. Autopilot okay, so we're going to head over towards our benefactor location. And of course, in the meantime, our Mercury Vanguard, I do want it to pick up these advanced electronics. We could do an energy cell trade just to rebuild our money quickly. I'm just looking for some bot energy cells. Okay. There's not a lot of them. Energy cells are pretty low demand. Well, we can go pick up our benefactor and we can, in theory, just leave the trader ship there and then... 
Yeah, we can we can just do this. This will be fine. We can leave the trader ship there. We can be building up our passive income for another one of those big trades and go pick up our benefactor at the same time. And maybe he'll pay us well for this and we can utilize that to invest in some cargo. Which would always be nice. Look at how much faster this uh, travel mode is going. That's nice. 3400? That's like 50% faster. In travel mode and regular mode. I'll take that kind of a, a speed increase. And it wasn't even all that expensive. Entering system. Black hole sun. I must admit, I am beginning to feel a bit tense. I do hope this goes to plan. It won't. I have further refined the plan. Please take a look. Uh-huh. I don't like it when he further refines the plan. Okay, well, we'll head over. Are we supposed to dock at this station? No, we are not. We are bypassing this station. Okay, fair enough. I have further refined the plan. Please take a look. Autopilot. Okay, Disengage. start the capturing tutorial to learn about taking over a ship. Sounds good to me. As you can see, I wish to escape the station via a chartered freighter. There are actually multiple ships involved, as to confound anyone wishing to track me. I would like you to protect any ship which should get into trouble. Okay. Well, there's a Mercury Vanguard over here. It's only 20 kilometers out. We're moving towards each other, so we're moving towards each other reasonably quickly, but I'm just going to boost over a little bit. There we go, something like this. So we need to escort this ship here. It appears to be in travel mode. So we will pursue. Is it going to dock up at this station? I think it is. Looks like it. Oh, maybe not. What's your plan, buddy? Maybe it is going to dock. Requesting permission to dock. Okay, so it is going to dock. We are also supposed to dock? Docking granted. Okay. Now we need to wait for the ship to Please launch. Wait for the ship to conclude its business. It will launch shortly. So actually I'm not gonna dock. Unless I actually have to. I'd rather just chill here. Maybe we have to actually dock. How do we utilize the docking computer? Oh, it's taking off. Never mind. I'm not going to need to dock, guys. I'm out of here. I don't think that that red ship over there is posing any threat to us currently. So I'll stick with this guy. He's moving at about 170 meters per second. He's working on accelerating. I'm 
just slow down a little bit here. Yeah, something like this. It's not moving very quickly if he's going to be going through this jump gate. I would uh, like it if you'd enter travel mode. That would be a good thing. Well, that's good. Where is the boron? I will check security logs. Oh, that didn't take long at all. It seems my disappearance has been noticed. I expect my ship is at a safe distance. I can't say the same for the others. Please be alert. I will order our ships to intercept targets. You will join them while I investigate further. Yes, brother. I am not at all certain that there are other ships. I think he's on this ship. There are no decoys. I'll do no such thing. Then prepare to die. Some excuse for a pirate you are. Discoverer, Vanguard. Was interesting. This guy still isn't in travel mode, by the way. <laughs> but that ship wasn't very difficult to take out. We got a couple things out of it. Hopefully they're valuable things. Because that would be a good thing. Thanks for your help. Okay. Excellent. We just got 10,000 credits for destroying that enemy, too. Thanks, Argon Federation. So we're holding right about here and still escorting this ship out of sector. I feel like the danger is over, though. I also feel like this is going to take them a very long time at this rate to get to the to get to the jump gate. Like, we're not even halfway there. Oh, they're entering travel mode now. Or not? They're not entering travel mode. Okay. I thought they were entering travel mode. But apparently, they have decided not to. Well, that could be a very, very long time indeed. Autopilot engaged. Well, we're just going to set the autopilot to following them for right now. And let's check in with our freighter over here. The price of the advanced electronics has actually dropped. Now, we still can't buy enough to fill our hold, which is unfortunate. I think we'll just continue chilling there for right now. Let's check in on our drill over here. I'm thinking that the problem with the drill is that there's nothing over here that's buying ore. Yeah, I mean, we could put in a buy order for ore here. I would kind of prefer to just build a storage on this station though like this is a dock module let's see here not sure what these ventures are we can check looks like that increases our max hull integrity okay fair enough I would very much like to get a uh, to get a storage here, but I'm not sure that we have a storage module available. Oh, we do. A container module. It could fit over here. 
or over here. Okay. And this would need claytronics, energy cells, and hull parts. That's fine. We'll confirm that for right now. Excellent. Of course, we don't currently have the money to uh, get those parts brought in, but that's okay. This would end up costing about 142,000 credits, which isn't too bad. But I'm not going to put that in just yet. We're still escorting this thing. And it still hasn't entered travel mode. And we're still... We're not quite halfway there. I don't know what's going on right now. But whatever. I guess while we're doing this, we might as well get this going. Like... We'll just buy these, ad what, ad what advanced electronics we can here. And then we'll sell them probably up here, since it's a little bit closer. Something like that. That'll make us 25, 26,000 credits. And it's better than just having the freighter sitting around anyway. So we'll, we'll just go ahead and do that. That shouldn't be a big deal. And then, of course, we can use those profits that we have from this to uh, come back down here and buy the advanced electronics when the price drops again and kind of keep doing this, honestly. Man, this thing is going slow. I may end up having to put a cut in here and uh, finishing that at another, like, finishing this off-camera, because it's going very slow. We can also buy advanced electronics over here. For nice and cheap, but there's only 24 available there. They actually manufacture them over here. Which is, rel actually, over here. Which is pretty convenient. But we want to get into manufacturing of those sorts of things. So that we can make even more ludicrous profits. I mean, this is already very profitable, but I think it'll be even more profitable in the future. Well, I mean, I know it'll be even more profitable in the future. But this advanced electronics thing, this definitely seems to be the way to go, at least for right now, based on the information that we have. I want 148 over here. Of course, 13, 18 there. Okay. Well, we'll be getting these trades, or rather the, these credits, quite soon. And that will allow us to go back down here and pick up even more advanced electronics. So that should be fine. However, I think I'm going to go ahead and put a cut in here. It's a little bit on the early side, but this is gonna take a while to get to the jump gate so i'm going to put a cut in here you can leave your offerings to the engagement gods in the form of likes comments subscribes and bell ringings and i will see you all next time when this guy leaves the sector <laughs> see you all then